Hello Leo, welcome to this reading. My name is Mia and today we are going to do a weekly reading for upcoming week which is July 18th through to 24th. Tell me Leo, how are you? I really hope you're doing great. I really hope you're doing great. Just keep in mind this is general reading so take the messages that resonate and drop the rest. Anyways, thank you so much for being here, spending time with me and this channel. And of course, liking, commenting and subscribing. Right, Leo, what is coming in for you next week? The moon card for swords. Page ones. A lot of signs actually got that one there. And we have chariots. Whoa. Some force in here. Okay. At the bottom, I'm going to take the card that resonates most with you, your energy and or message from universe. Okay, <laughs> interesting. It kind of feels that there is some sort of message coming in for you to prepare for unexpected and to pray for and to, and to prepare yourself um, mentally, physically, and spiritually. There is some serious message here. So, judgment. Judgment is always saying, I'm not here to judge you. I'm here to set you free from all your past or everything in the past that you had was negative, right? And I'm here to set you free from all these feelings of guilt, regret, etc. Look, these are Archangel Raphael wings here. It's their healing time. And as well, what goes around comes around. And you need to forget your, forgive yourself first. Before you can move on. And you need to forgive maybe others as well. Because this is some sort of journey is coming along. There is some sort of journey coming along. But you need to get rid of this old baggage. That is somehow appears. And appears now and then in a lifetime. Appears in different situations. And the judgment is kind of saying. Look, clear this out once and for all. So you can move on. And sometimes we somehow we want to uh, keep dragging and dwelling on the same. And the, the one, even though it's negative, we kind of don't want to really let go. But judgment is telling, please do. Because you will benefit so much when you start fresh, when your head is clean. And when you are kind of like a new slate is coming in here, Leo. The moon. There is something you can't see. <laughs> <laughs> Very obvious, right? But there is something in horizon awaiting you to be ready. It's just the universe and the whole world and everyone else is literally waiting for you to be ready. Because they are ready for you to take the journey. Whatever that is. It could be meeting some person. But if you haven't done your homework and have done your spring cleaning regarding your um, beliefs or people around you if you haven't done that it will be pointless to meet someone because it's not gonna last it's gonna be pointless to go and find a job or start something because you are not ready for success because something needs to be definitely clear and cleared and you might actually get messages throughout your dreams as well and they might feel weird but listen what they are saying to you and Maybe sometimes I write even down. There is kind of the four of swords coming as well is a relax. You need to kind of have kind of meditative state. Even when you're walking, it's kind of try not to get upset, not to wound up of everything that happens around you just for a little bit. Kind of get yourself in kind of this zone of, I not I wouldn't say I don't care, but really kind of. I'm in your little bubble and try to keep this positive vibes going. Try, look, habits. What is habits? We, the way we think is a habit, right? We think um, more or less around 90% the same old, same old thoughts on and on and on. That is a habit, right? As soon as you catch yourself that you are thinking the same thought that is going nowhere or is negative, cut it out. 
literally force yourself to think of something else look at somewhere or observe something count to 10 whatever it is mind is like a muscle you need to work that because there is something beautiful coming and you need to be ready um you need to be really on top of your game here and this is card as well telling like spend time on things that you enjoy even daydreaming something that gives you really positive vibes this that's how you can charge yourself with positivity and even um kind of aspirations and things and even though might feel that oh i'm never gonna get that or oh it's not for me or i'm too old or etc etc allow yourself go through these positive emotions because your mind doesn't know is it true or not have some funny games have some kind of playful games with your mind and positively charge and think of what if i succeed because here we have let's say you have rested you have done your homework you are prepared and once you reach that point there is a great and really and and actually that's going to feel like unbelievable offer there will be an offer or some sort of idea or something will pop out for you to see and at first might have seen that mm, if you're in this old phase leo you probably wouldn't realize that you wouldn't even notice it because you have done your homework and you have cleansed yourself you have really charged yourself with positivity you will notice that either it's adward for some job or some travel or anything or a pass even you will notice it and even though it feels like so big and wondering and you come up you probably will be wondering whether you can achieve that is it for you yes it is the parents are there they are far away but not too far not to get there and even though he hasn't started moving the the the, the offer is there the idea is there and it's so big you know when your belly is full of this joy and and real passion there is no place for fear and these ones are talking about your willpower as much as is chariot because chariot is pure mind over matter simple as that you know it feels like Leo, you need to not to go to the gym but this is going to be your brain gym you need to work on that muscle called brain because if you don't control your mind someone else will and that is not what you want no 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 self-discipline there is a very strong kind of ask and that probably sometimes is a big ask it feels like military action um action to take and self-discipline is really need to be um uh, be it present but you can do it leo you've done it before and you can do it again because this is going to be something you can't see yet but you are making this foundation for something really uh i would even say as strong as life changing or ch you changing there is something amazing there you know like when you prepare the ground for sowing seeds this is what you need to do first prepare the basics to prepare yourself wow what a lot of fun is there i know some sounds like google dukes but this before you <clears throat> if you just go in this journey without doing homework without um, meditating without being positive you will not have a good outcome or you will have the outcome that's not satisfying so please don't be lazy <laughs> go to the mind gym work on it and see what happens Alrighty, leos if this is it for you then thumbs up thank you very much let's have a look what angel um, symbolisms would like to add for you here we go wheel of fortune the change is coming and we have butterfly it's kind of like letting yourself free free of yourself freeing yourself from this whatever there needs to go and sometimes if you are not aware you can do a quite a little meditation and actually say it inside within you saying i'm letting go of all negativity and imagine like as if like vacuum is hoovering out all the negativity 
and then cleanse yourself with um, beautiful water and then charge yourself with the light. Here you are like starting a new something really, really precious and important. Yes, indeed. Let's have a look what angel messages from angels are here for you, Leo. Let's have a look. This one is coming. Yes, indeed, you are at the end of a cycle in your life. Call upon your angels to comfort you and to guide you to your next step. Happiness awaits you now. Look, happiness is awaiting. Everyone's waiting for you to be ready. You're not probably ready yet, but you will know when you are. Right, this is amazing. One more card, please. Ho, ho, ho. Another Archangel Raphael. Look at the wings in both cards. Interesting. I'm, I, I am healing. I'm helping you heal. And I'm, I am healing physical challenges in yourself and others. You are a healer like me. And for some of you, you might actually become a spiritual teacher or some sort of um, inspiration to others. And that is very important. All right, Leo, that's all I have for you today. Have a great week and I'll see you in the next reading. Bye-bye.